Welcome back from Graphic Extras. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you the Bad TV plugin. It's for the PC, Photoshop, PSP, it's 32 bit only, and it's available in the Andrews Plugins Volume 10. Now, the plugin's got uh, well, fairly basic functionality, it creates a bad TV image. So, if you want a bad TV image, this is one you want to get. Obviously, nowadays, hopefully with HDTV, etc., you won't get too many pictures like this. So, uh, it creates lots of different lines. You can change the quantity of the lines and make it more intense or separate the lines. You can also apply different shifts of the lines so it can move up slightly. And you can also move, which is actually just moves the underlying image so you get a sort of blurring of the image, which again is something you really don't want, obviously, for your TV. But uh, this is a, a quick. So, quick guide to some of the functionality of the plugin. Also, if you uh, modify the mixing settings, you can actually mix the underlying image as well as the uh, on the different channels. So you can uh, there's the green channel and the blue channel. Just increase that a bit, and you can create very interesting sort of line designs as well. As with all the plugins in the Andrew plugin sets, there's also different blend modes, which is there's a hundred options. So you can blend the actual resulting image with these different options such as linear obviously with that one I'm just going to remove that I'm just going to blend just quickly click for a few of those you can see different color effects that can be achieved using the blend so I'll just click OK at that point of course once you've done that you can actually apply it again again and again you can use the plugin with the smart filters and you can convert for smart filters so you can apply multiple copies of the plugin and they're non destructive. You can use it in Photoshop Actions as well as scripting. I'm just going to get rid of that and I'm just going to go back to the plugin. It's in the noise folder. So it's just there. Just zoom in slightly. And there's other options you can use, such as combining with overlays, different post processing overlays, which are gradients. So you can create weird and wonderful color designs. Also, you can use different effects modes and much more. That's the plugin Bad TV from graphicextras.com.